A world without conjunctions. What are we gonna do? A world without but. This is gonna be bad. That's a cool costume. Are you going to be a knight for Halloween? Yeah, it's a cool costume. I'm gonna be brave for Halloween. Huh? Well, that moment of, of, of confusion could be lifted by just putting a simple conjunction in there. Does anyone know what that conjunction is? But! Let's try it out and see how it works. This should clarify the sentence to make it a lot more easier to understand. That's a cool costume. Are you going to be a knight for Halloween? Yeah, it's a cool costume, but I'm going to be ready for Halloween. Yeah, that's how the sentence should be. A world without or. Oh no. Have you decided what you're going to be for Halloween? Oh, that's right. You're going to be ready. Maybe I shouldn't be Ray. I've made a list of things that I could be instead of her. I could be a vampire. No place in town really sells good things. What about Robin Hood? Um, no offense, but you don't look so good in green. I could be a devil. I could be a pumpkin. I could be a witch. I could be a queen. I could be a mummy. I could be an alien. I could be a snowman. I could even be a ketchup bottle. What are you babbling? This conversation would have been a lot more linguistically better with the use of a conjunction. Or, let's try it out and see how it works. It should bring the sentence to its full potential. Have you decided what you're going to be for Halloween yet? Oh, that's right. You are going to be Ray. Maybe I shouldn't be Ray. I have a list of things that I could be instead of her. I could be a vampire. Well, no place in town really sells good things. What about a rock? What about Robin Hood? Uh, green doesn't look like it's best on you. I could be a devil, or a pumpkin, or a witch, or a queen, or a mummy, or an alien, or a snowman, or a ketchup bottle. Well, I personally like the ketchup bottle, but those are good ideas. Yeah, that's how the sentence should be. Or can make sentences a lot shorter. Except for this one. It was very world long. without and. I don't even want to think What's about that book it. You're reading? It's called Fable Haven. I just love the fantasy books. Yeah, fantasy is such a good genre. I also like sci-fi books. Sci-fi is okay. I also like poetry. Uh, poetry is fine. I, I don't really like. It. I also like horror. Horror is a little bit too scary for me. I like uh, stuff. Combine all of those independent clauses into one or two or three sentences. I don't know how many favorite book genres you have, but if you continue saying, I like, I like, I like, I like, we're going to be all sitting here for an hour listening to you. So, just add a conjunction. And, what's a conjunction? I don't know. Let's find out! This is what could happen if we lived in a world without conjunctions. What a scary thought. Starring Zoya Nicola and her little sister, Aliza. Yay!